And now, the third installment of the greatest show you've seen in the past eight seconds. Guess that game! Brought to you by the Play On Game Channel. Number one. This is a roguelike game developed and published by Supergiant Games in September 2020, which followed an early release access in December 2018. The game takes place in the Underworld, where the main character must escape to reach Mount Olympus, at times aided by the gifts bestowed upon him from other Olympians. Each run challenges the player through a random series of rooms populated with enemies and rewards. While players will often die, they can use gained treasure to improve certain attributes or unlock new weapons and abilities to improve chances of escaping on subsequent runs. Couple seconds left, Let's see if you get it. Time. The answer is. Hades! Number 2. This is a 2015 action role playing game developed by From Software and published by Sony for the PlayStation 4. It follows the main character, a hunter, through the decrepit, gothic Victorian area whose inhabitants are afflicted with a bloodborne disease which transforms them into horrific beasts. Attempting to find the source of the plague, the player's character unravels the sea's mysteries while fighting beasts and cosmic beasts. This game was released in March 2015 to critical acclaim. A couple seconds left, let's see if you can get this one. And time. The answer is... Bloodboard! Number 3. This is a 2019 action-adventure game developed by Respawn Entertainment and published by EA. The story is set in the Star Wars universe, five years after Star Wars Episode III, Revenge of the Sith. The game began development as an original title, unrelated to Star Wars, but EA felt the action would work well as a Star Wars game, convincing Lucasfilm to authorize and consult on the project. The game received generally favorable reviews, with critics praising the game's combat, characters, and performance, selling more than 10 million copies by 2020. Let's see if you can get this one. The answer is... Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order! Number 4 This is a 1991 graphic adventure game by Sierra Online. It was released on floppy disks in 1991 and CD-ROM in 1992 with full speech support. It featured 256 hand-painted graphics and a fully mouse-driven interface. It was one of the first video games to use motion capture animation and cost over a million dollars to produce, selling more than its three predecessors combined. In this installment, the hero embarks on a time travel adventure through past games from the series both past and future. A reborn villain from a previous game attacks him, trying to kill him this time. And time. The answer is... Space Quest 4! Number 5! This is a free-to-play action role-playing game developed and published by Grinding Gear Games. The player controls a single character from an overhead perspective and explores large outdoor areas or caves and dungeons, battling monsters or fulfilling NPC quests to gain experience points and equipments. This game takes place in a dark fantasy world where the government of one island nation exiles people to a ruined continent, a home to many ancient gods. Players are then tasked with fighting their journey back, defeating ancient gods and great evils along their way. Let's see if you can get this one. And time. The answer is... Path of Exile! Number 6. This is a free-to-play survival game by Smartly Dressed Games, a studio consisting solely of Canadian game designer Nelson Sexton. This game features several game modes, all of which consist of the same basic concept of zombie survival, along with multiple difficulty settings. This was one of the most popular games on Steam in 2014, and the game's popularity was unexpected to all, since the game is mainly developed by a single person without a major studio's resources. A couple seconds left, this one's pretty cool. And time. The answer is... UNTURNED! Number 7! This is a 2022 action game by Valve, a spin-off of the Portal series, the game serves as a tech demo for the newly released Steam Deck, with most of the game taking place in front of a desk that acts as an in-world representation of the console. A core arrives and tasks the player with testing toilet, but a defective toilet destroys a transport pipe, inspiring the core to try and pitch a new idea to the heads of the company. The game was praised for its design and sense of humor. A couple seconds left. And time. The answer is 
Aperture desk job. Number eight. This is a story-based video game designed and written by developers Davey Redden and William Pugh. The game carries themes such as choice in video games, the relationship between game creator and player, and predestination and fate. In game, the player guides a silent protagonist along narration by British actor Kevin Brighton. As the story progresses, the player is confronted with diverging pathways. Depending on the choices made, the player will encounter different endings before the game resets back to the beginning. Couple seconds left. And time. The answer is... The Stanley Parable! Number 9. Okay, this one's for me. This is a 1998 bowling game for the Nintendo 64. Developed by Player One and published by Crave Entertainment, the game takes place in a space setting with our intergalactic bowling alleys. The game features six playable characters, 12 galactic lanes, six types of bowling balls, and multiplayer modes including up to four players simultaneously, and a variety of special moves to throw your opponent. I always had a blast with this one. Couple seconds left, let's see if you can get it. And time. The answer is... Milo's Astrolades! Number 10. Last one. This is a gold mining simulator based on the smash hit Discovery Channel series. Sit behind the wheel of many vehicles in the gold mining operation depending on the skills of your player. Experiencing the challenging life of a chief mechanic, various parts of the machine will break when the least expect and cost money. Keep improving your mining business and explore a big detailed world with four unique mining claims and fully deformable terrain. Sell what you can find and win big. A couple seconds left. Let's see if you can get this one. And time. The answer is... Gold Rush the Game! Hey, how'd you do tonight? Did you get them alright? Week 3 out of the way. If you have any games that you want me to include in the next video, put them in the Discord. Check the description box for the link. And if you're not subbed to play on Game Channel, now's the time. Do it. See you next week.